Excuse me, I'm just gonna grab these chests. Thank you, Phoenix. Didn't really help me all that much, but eh. Go make a pillow. I probably don't have all the Gorgon eyes, though. But I just hate it when games are like this, where it's like, if you know what to do, it's fun. And you can actually get through it decently, because you know all the pitfalls and all the things. But man. And this is for not goddamn helping me. Phoenix. God damn it. Where? Why does it change? Just have two goddamn uh, little. Oh, is it, is it counterclockwise or clockwise? It's like, oh, but we suck so much. We have to make it be this one big old guessing game. Mer. After the annoyingness you put me through, game, I'm not in the mood for the bullshit. See? Feels like it's completely different inputs even though it's the same one. My eyes, it tricks me. God damn! Good music and animation, though. Just wish the gameplay was a little bit less annoying. Everything is slow. Yay. That's not gonna get annoying. Not at all. Bleg. Once again, just wish games would have decent, like, overall completion. I guess, have to... Knock, knock, up and up the door, it's fucking pissed! Want things to go well? Happy? Hope the game will let me. Ring the Kronos bell. God damn it. Sure, if I have to ring this multiple times or what? Oh. There we go. Take this, Athena. At least I think you're Athena. Pissed off that even if you're not Athena, you're now Athena. In terms of how much I hate you. I want it's not what I want. It's not what I want. Pull the lever. Make it do things.
Now I don't know what this will do. Oh. <laughs> oh, motherfucker. Hate the stuff like this. Rise up. Take this, Athena. <laughs> knock, knock up under the door. It's real again. And still really pissed. I'm just not done yet because I want those other chests got. Oh. That's a thing I could do. Stop time. I keep forgetting that's a thing I can do. Oh my god, why do they have to make it annoying? It's extra stuff, therefore we can. Once again, fixed camera perspective is so fun. Stop making me jump all over the place, god damn it! God fucking damn it! I fucking hate fixed camera perspective! Just let me fucking look where I wanna fucking look so I can actually fucking do what I wanna fucking do. It being an optional extra thing does not make it any less annoying when I can't do it properly because of the weirdness of the game! It hurts so much. Get on it, God. Please just let me jump through. God damn it. Stop. I just grab off her. Go ahead, put it all in there. Oh, I hope to beat some people's asses till they are dead. Beat their ass black and red, and then make them all dead. Black of decayed flesh, red of blood. Hey, hey. Batesies. You pissed me off. Only one fate. And we finally meet in person. Will we fight you? Are you our friend? We've been expecting you. Out of my way. Your resolve is admirable. Even if it is misguided. None can change their destiny, Kratos. We sisters determine the fate of all. Well, you're arrogant. It was I who deemed that the Titans lose the Great War. And I who have allowed you to come this far. It is not your destiny to kill Zeus. You no longer control my destiny. I see Gaia has filled you with her lies. I have warned you. Let me pass. <laughs> you have always amused us, Fatal. But know this, mortal. There is no power greater than the Sisters of Fate. If you challenge us, you will die. Well, I'm gonna challenge you.
What was that noise? Stop moving. Ow. 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 This mechanic is simple and easy. Grabber. Okay, that's bullshit. Uh, hate the annoyingness. Yay! There we go. Well, you're crazy. We control your destiny, foolish mortal. With a win, we can end your life. <laughs> or allow you to live. Search your memory. If you could really do that, you would have done it to us already. enemies yay ah enemies I 
like this. No, I won't die. Why is it? Why did it show this part? Don't look onto them. I get these guys' purpose, but they're really annoying. Waiting for the inputs. Square. Square. Oh. Can't be that easy. Can't be that easy. And old Kratos doesn't even notice. Lock the fade away. It's what you get, you monstrous monster. This power was never meant for a mortal like you. Well, here we go again, ladies and gentlemen. Don't know what to do with this boss. It's like I keep doing the same thing and it seems to have results and then we get to this point and I don't know what to goddamn do. And they don't tell me anything. Oh. Well, that's not a too so weird or anything. That is not what I fuck you game. <laughs> fuck you game. Oh, the one time that I actually know what I'm doing, you decide to fuck me anyway because of your shit of game design. Why are these even here? They don't really need to be here anymore. Activate the Amulet of Fates, they say. That you're supposed to use the Amulet of Fates when she does that because, oh my god, we've never done this before! Have a low-end enemy of the f Fates, like, oh, this is a trial of the Fates, and then... Have it be a tool tip. Tell us what to do. Have precedent. Boss fights are meant to test your knowledge on things that you've already done, not introduce new things that are never going to come up again. Okay, that was bullshit. I hit her before she started with stupid ability. Yay. Seriously, this game is shit at telegraphing me. Fuck you, game!
I still don't know what to do. That's it. Fuck it. Going back. I'm not dealing with this bullshit. You had your chance to, to telegraph what I'm supposed to do. All right. All right. Where the f Oh, you're not supposed to banish her back to the goddamn mirror. Hate this boss fight. No telegraphing whatso fucking ever. Hey, this would be cool. Oh, lock onto the one that actually needs it. Damn. Now I have to do this a few more times, I'm guessing. Once again, this game, this this fight is the worst. It has no telegraphing whatsoever, goddamn ever, what you're meant to do. Goddamn continued well on this and break the mirror. There we goddamn go. I'm not even reading that far into the fight wiki just so I can try and figure out the rest of it myself because I don't want to look at guides, but I will if the game forces me to. Destroy, destroy, destroy! Fuck. That is the worst mo telegraphed boss fight of all goddamn time. Because here's the thing. You want to know how I would fix that fight. You want to know how I would fix that fight. Okay? What you do... Is... You telegraph the, these things to the player by simply having these things happen before. And what I mean by that is, before you fight the Fate Sisters, what you need to have happen is have the player fight a mini-boss. In which they need to use the Talisman of Fate to slow down time for whatever reason when they're in a certain state to damage them. But even then, this one is so clunky, because what you need to do with this fight is beat up the main one until she gets to the down state, use the Amulet of Fate, beat up the other one until she gets into a down state, and then retreats back into the mirror, and then break the mirror, so that's a three-step program. And it's just, it would be, a, it's nearly impossible to convey, in my opinion. It's so goddamn hard to properly convey. Because it's all so fast. That's why if you that's why it should just be beat her up when she comes out of the mirror and then that just breaks that mirror. There shouldn't be any other way about it. It's just like why? Why? Why was it so stupidly designed? And like now that I know what to do, it's fine. But they were so shit at conveying that. It just boggles my mind. I have no idea how you would convey that to a player, though. So I don't even know how you would fix it. God damn. 
Oh my god! Ah! It's like this. It, that would just be so hard to convey. So stinking hard to convey. But some of it you could convey. Like again, the mini boss to tell the player, okay, you need to do this at some point, and then that player, and then the player will keep that in mind. Like, oh, it's like you might be like. And that's the thing, just have the frickin' prompt come up! Just have the prompt come up! Why didn't they have the prompt come up? That would've fixed the first problem! Yeah, basically, to fix this boss fight, all you need to do is make the prompt come up! And then secondly, have the mirror shatter when you beat up on the, on the mirror one, instead of just having it be like, Oh, it's somewhat broken, now you need to finish it off. Unless, during the second stage of the fight, when you're fighting the mirror one in the, like, mirror past, the way to beat her is you knock her into a mirror, and then you just wail, wail, and she goes into the mirror, and then you shatter the mirror, and then that would give some kind of precedent. So, like, I don't know. This could have been done better. This could have been done a lot better. And they didn't. It's just like, why? Ugh. But that's it. I'm done. I made it a decent way into the game, played five hours, and that boss fight I just need to recuperate and hopefully the rest of the game isn't as annoying. But this is the one thing that I notice so much in video games, where they have this one thing that they do really, really well, and then either through incompetence, not fucking having the buttons come up, or just not conveying things to the player, like, oh, you uh, took damage and now your Icarus rings failed during the little twirly whirl lava part. Or just annoying from the start, like the slow spikes plus gate part. And it's just like, the, the when it comes to me, these are the top important things. Convey things to the player, teach the mechanics of a boss fight to the player so they know how to fight the boss when they fight the boss. And no insta-deaths. No goddamn insta-deaths anywhere. Insta-deaths are the bane of existence. They're the epitome of bad design. Unless you give clear warning and a chance to recover, insta-deaths should not be in a game. Ever. But so far, the things that really should have been done to fix up this game is have a universal, like, oh, that would fix it. That would fix one of the problems. So many times, I'm just like, I didn't know I could climb the surface. Like, the wall in the ice-fire puzzle. The walls... I forget exactly where, but that wasn't really a problem in that last part. But, and then when it came to the Kraken's tentacles. Have glowing vertical stripes. Boom. Just glowing energy vertical stripes. And be like, aha, that is the, an indication that I can climb this. Teach boss fight mechanics to a player. It's like, oh, I need to be able to use the Amulet of Fates on some enemies. Oh, I need to shatter the mirror to take out this Sister of Fate permanently. That kind of thing. Conveying things to the player is the utmost importance. And literally 99% of my problems with this game would be stinking. Fixed if they just conveyed it better. God damn. But I'm going to take a break. And I'm going to return to this another day. With recharged thoughts, recharged batteries, and hopefully would be, a and hopefully the rest of the game is good. Not sucky puzzles. Oh yeah, but that still doesn't save the game when it stinking had that soft lock. That's so annoying. Why it had that, I don't know. Oh, we put a save right before this soft lock area, so that makes it okay. No! It's just the little things. The little things get to me so much. But yeah, I'm going to take a break. We come back another day, another stream, and hopefully it'll be fun. Hopefully it'll be good. Hopefully it'll be good. Mm -hmm. Anyway, I've been Neon Icy Wings, and this has been the God of Pain, too. The God of Pain and Stupid Puzzles. And I'll see you all next time. God of Life! <laughs>